I'm going to show you some different options that will help you when you're selecting your pictures for editing. So when you have a picture that's the same and you're trying to decide between them, you can either click on a picture that you don't want to save. So say this one I was not going to save. I can set a flag and then say for this one I also was not going to save so I can flag it and then say this one I would like to keep and this one I would like to keep. If I come up to edit and I can click on select flagged photos it's going to highlight the pictures that I set a flag for. So any picture that I flagged and say the ones that I'm flagging are the ones I'm not keeping it's going to highlight all of them. So then I can just click on the picture down here click remove photos and it's going to remove all the flagged photos Another option is, is say you want to flag the ones that you do want to keep. So I'm going to flag the ones that I would like to keep and edit. And then I'm going to go to edit, select flag photos, and it's going to highlight the ones that I flagged, and then I'm going to edit the ones that are highlighted. Another option is for a picture that you don't want to keep, you can flag it as rejected. So when you flag it as rejected, it's going to kind of like white out the picture down here. And over here. So you can see how the picture looks. This one is kind of like whited out and it has an X through the flag and then say this one we are going to keep and we're going to set a flag to keep it, that's going to have a little white flag right there. And that's not going to be whited out. So that is an option to help you select your photos. Another option is you can set a color label. So say the ones that you don't want to keep you can set as red. So I'm going to flag all the ones I don't want to keep as red. Then the ones that I would like to keep I can set as a different color. So just say I'm going to pick yellow. And then when I'm going through my photos all the ones that I set as red I can just go through and delete them and then keep all the ones that I set as yellow and then I can edit all the ones that I set as yellow.